trap and keep people at 2v1 bay and then, you know, let Pac-Man kind of charge up all those tools that make him so deadly. And Bowser Jr., a character with a similar amount of tools, and right away you see the game plan. Yeah. Right? You see Bowser Jr. R running forward and trying to catch these quick aerials as Lev drops back and camps a little <laughs> bit. That's another thing that makes Pac-Man ridiculous in doubles is the insane uh -oh. recovery and ability to go for those combos, <laughs> but Lev not able to make it back this time. Well, you see, the recovery's so insane, it's a little bit difficult to calculate sometimes. <laughs> you know, you gotta give it up. Yeah, so many factors you can go so far. Easy to overestimate, as Noodle does get caught with a combo. And despite an early stock loss for Lev, uh, the yellow team both at very high percents could lose it pretty quickly here. Ooh, oh, as you God. miss a tech there, and Lev immediately making up for his mistake. I don't think it was quite that weird uh, Rob anti-tech that was going around where like you could neutral air him at zero and like if he bounces off the stage he just died at zero. Oh I uh, saw that. Yeah, yeah yeah. I don't think it was that but Rob most definitely flew across the stage. Speaking <laughs> of flying. Pac-Man just flying here with a side B KO into a trampoline recovery. Wow. Yeah pac man so hard to spike right because <laughs> that'll be right below stage. Just gonna bounce him right back up. Uh -oh. Ooh, Lev get caught with a couple of projectiles in a row. Team full of snipers over here on the yellow side of things. Yeah, not a team combo without the actual physical characters being there. It was laser into the soccer ball. Yeah. <laughs> what a wild yeah, It was a world. team combo on the left side of the stage, but both characters <laughs> were on the right side of the stage. Not something you see very often, as Leb immediately surges forward with that F smash, goes for another one on Noodle, and Monty functioning as a very effective stock tank so far, uh -oh. keeping this game very much in the balance. Not able to finish that combo on Lev on the right side there. Yeah, I'm surprised we did not see the rotor arm to try and, you know, make some shenanigans happen. But, you know, Anchovy's going for the guaranteed damage and honestly putting Lev in a very shocking scenario where that f tilt will take it. Lev not going to hesitate to take that stock. And now looking at this, it's real even all of a sudden. Mm -hmm. Despite the early stock, despite the explosiveness that we've seen on the yellow side of things, uh, it's it, it's been all red team since then. They put on a lot of damage, but Noodle another F smash. Uh -oh. Monty and Lev are both going to have to find some survivability here. Yeah, I don't know. Some things are kind of happening on the yellow team side, and Noodle is just like finding a lot of KOs uh, with this deep breathing F tilt. Mm. Uh, it's one of the trickiest moves in doubles because it comes out so fast and kind of hits like a smash attack. Yeah, he's he, he's very frequently finding uh, finding the red team slipping on their punishes, and yet again, Affair is going to send off stage. Lev has to make it back here if he wants a shot at winning this game, mm -hmm. and he does. Yes, a great recovery, but Lev really risking it all down there. Gonna shield the entirety of the rotor arm. What a scary scenario, Whoa. but you know, Pac-Man is immortal, they say. He lives forever. He, he does just that as the Nair is gonna try and cut down his opponent's life a little short. Anachobi's at 181 on the second stock here. That's the X Factor so far in this game. Can they get that stock off of him? Wow, and Lev just time and time again is able to hang on this stock in scenarios where I think he would lose it in the Salute the Sun, but doesn't go out without a fight. Does take an anchovy stock, but it's not enough. We're down to a 1v1. Can we finish it off the up yeah. air? Yeah, yeah, I was going to say, preventing perfect the eye <laughs> doesn't even matter regardless. Anchovy's able to clean it up and not allow Monty the 1v1 opportunity. Yes, very solid game one there. I mean, even in the quote unquote slower matchups, these double sets can get crazy explosive. Yeah, yeah, especially a team like like Pac-Man and Bowser Jr. both have that combo potential. Mm. And one thing that you see very often in doubles as Pac-Man is catching your opponent off stage without a jump. Yes. And Pac-Man just has a plethora of options to punish that with ferocity. Yes. It can yes, be nares and fares and dares to just send you all the way to the bottom corner, helplessly falling, no jump to speak of. Yeah, I mean, Pac-Man just has ridiculous edge guarding potential for no reason. This character already has so <laughs> much in his kit. It's quite overloaded. Like, why does he need a box like that? Yeah, that kidding me? Why does wild. he need a frame three nair or whatever it may be? <laughs> Getting off into this next game, we'll see if Lev can utilize that. That was a difference maker in game one, was that early stock that Lev lost. If he can hold on to it this time, uh, him and Monty are going to be a threat. Oh yeah, oh yeah, I can see it for sure. Oh my goodness! He got his teammate with it! Yeah, and unfortunately, like I said, Pac-Man's immortal. Uh, he got spiked by the same <laughs> move and actually just survived, because why not? Yeah, this this cheese wheel is hard to pin down. <laughs> Catching him with the side B, Noodle remains alive. And now the low up B, Lev keeps himself on stage. He had a difficult time doing that earlier. Yeah, yeah, I was like a little hit. worried, you know. Didn't go for the second bounce, just kind of went for that first bounce. And I'm like, okay, you better make it back. I like it. I like the quick recovery, not, not getting scared to go for it, right? Sitting on his laurels, it got him this far, it won't fail him now. 
Yeah, that's one of my complaints about Pac-Man in doubles. Sometimes his recovery can kind of take a country year. Takes forever. <laughs> yeah, and you leave your your teammate in kind of no man's land over there for too long, and some nasty, wicked things could happen. Oh, Monty was in no man's land for a while, <laughs> but Lev just ran up and F smashed. Yeah, gave him a little company. Oh my goodness, the surviving. Tech, yeah, that, that's really great. The callous walls, but not going to save you there. Can't tech the blast zone, bud. Lev's disadvantage has been phenomenal. It's, it's been so hard to take a quick stock off for him. Ooh, Ooh. and the latest hit of wow. Anchovy side B, and he's immediately going to lose that stock. And that's a homie teammate. You know, coming back in is like, you lost your stock, but I'm here to avenge it. Said, I got you, buddy. <laughs> I got you, buddy. The homie stock, if you will. Yes, indeed. And, that, and now Noodle caught off stage. Lev is going to ch Oh, no! Lev tried to chase it out, but Noodle with the reversal of all reversals to bring this game back to even. Yeah, he said, I'll stomp you out like a summer ant. And I'll keep stomping. <laughs> stomp out the fire that Lev had going. Yeah. And now Anchovies and Noodle working on Lev, catching him in the middle. Keeps himself alive, though. All right. Like I said, this, this game has been so explosive. And on Kalos of all stages, just gave a lot more room for the scrap to kind of be a lot more readable as things have been going wild on both sides of the stage here. Lev chasing way up high with the, <laughs> with the side B. And the more you know, I never thought I'd see this. I just saw Pac-Man Bear punish Rob Nair. <laughs> hey, <laughs> a couple seconds happens. ago, a little parry into Pac-Man Nair. Never thought I'd see that happen. As both red, red players holding on for dear life. Lev and Monty both in opposite corners, struggling. But Lev's struggle turns into success as Anchovies takes some extra damage. 144 Ooh. on the last stock as Monty loses his. And that's why deep breathing is so potent, because you can just eviscerate stocks out of nowhere with random moves. Interesting. Opting not to oh, take yeah, the stock. It. Let's Noodle hold on to it. And that's exactly <laughs> why, right? Yeah. You want to give Noodle a chance here. And he's proven, proven effective in these 2v1s. Just can he catch Lev off guard and find a kill here? Yeah, uh, unfortunately, Monty is just going to take point here as sitting at 28%. It's going to just be like a 1v1, except Noodle cannot commit to any hard, you know, low, I mean, yeah. high lag moves. Can't grab, can't do that jab. It's, it, it's really hard to set things up here if you're Noodle. But he's kind of able to reverse things, give himself wow. a chance at Lev. The downer is not going to do it. Thank God, Kalos platforms. Yeah, and then that's the thing is that even if Noodle does secure a hit onto Lev, he could just use Pac-Man's insane recovery to go super high and give Monty time to kind of shift his focus. Monty with a flurry of back airs to Ow. threaten Noodle, and there's the F-Tilt. We have ourselves in a 1v1, folks. Yeah, that was the one thing you did not want to happen if you are red team because Lev dropping the stock there puts it in a scary scenario here. Mid percents on both of them. Either character can find a lot of kills right now. A lot of players get buffed in these 1v1s Ooh. after doubles. You got to do it for your teammate. The pride of your partner is on the line. The Nair, Monty going to send Noodle to the other side. Stuck on that Kalos platform. Never the place to be, but immediately puts himself back in a comfort spot. Um, and the movement is coming in. You know, you see Monty just going from side plat to side plat, trying to find the opening. But Noodle has been holding down center uh, uncharacteristically well. Monty needs to do it for his teammate as pressure builds. Mm -hmm. Noodle going to send off stage, but not quite. Monty stays so That's safe. The jab, it. is that enough? Whoa. Certainly that'll do it. Grounds him into the up smash. A phenomenal finish there for Noodle. Gets it done in the 1v1. Sends them further into this top eight. Yeah, the we fit jab. Not a berry I expect to get a full punish off of, yeah. but Noodle just quick to the draw, kind of the fastest we fit in the West here, getting that up smash and sending it home with a 2 0 victory. Yeah, a little, uh, that's kind of the niche character thing yeah. where you're like, oh, I'm getting jabbed at 120 from across the stage. I'll be fine. I'll be fine. And then you get buried and you get up smash. Like, yeah. Wait a minute, whoa, that's whoa. not supposed to happen. That's not how that works. That's not how that works, but, uh, Phenomenal ability there in the 2v1 from Noodle. Not something you see succeed very frequently. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. And very good stuff. So, we got a lot of great.